Hey guys, hey everyone, how are y'all doing out there? It's your girl, Divine Feminine Twin D. <laughs> and thank you for stopping by my channel. Thank you for being here. Thank you so, so much for your support. Thanks to everyone who has been purchasing their money magnet bracelets, their lip oils, their protection bracelet, and especially your books. This one. Because it is very, very informative. And trust me, once you read this book, you will have no doubt whether you're a twin flame or not. There's only two things this book can do for you. One, clarify if you're a twin flame. Yes, let you know yes. Or two, let you know you are not. Okay? But anyways, guys. That's the best thing you can ever do for yourself. So you can save yourself some heartache and pain or choose to stay on this journey like me. Hmm. Anyways, let's give God Almighty thanks for bringing us here together. Safe and sound, alive and well. I almost choked there, you know. <laughs> let's, let's pray, guys. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For that is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. All right, Divine Feminines. Let's see what's going on with your Divine Masculine because I'm also getting like this gloomy energy. Like, Okay, I don't know what's happening here. And I'm getting some gloomy energy. Let's see what's going on, guys. Okay, Father God, what's happening with these divine masculines? What can you tell me, please, that's happening with these divine masculines? And this is almost an emergency message. Someone should know something here. Someone should know something, so pay attention. Pay attention. Okay, boss. See, that's the reason... They're in this energy, worried, nervous, anxious. These are my masculines are ready to take a leap of faith. But they're nervous, anxious. Your divine masculine here is ready to put the past behind them and move forward towards your destiny. I am ready to roll. They're ready to put the hard work in, Divine Feminine. They're ready to put the hard work in. When they walked away from you in the past, they didn't want to. But like I always say, this is a salmon, guys. Salmon swim upstream. Your person is coming back towards you. While all those old emotions are flowing downstream, going out of sight, out of mind empty cups they're returning to their person taking that leap of faith hmm. so your your divine masculine is nervous nervous three 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 about this step that they're going to take and they're they're gonna rush in here you go with the knight of swords here you go they're gonna rush in they have truth they have clarity God is guiding them and protecting them. But there's still this little energy of what if, what if, what if, what if they don't accept me? But they're nervous. Seven of Wands in the reverse. This is them opening up their heart. Your Divine Masculine was like in this limbo in regards to Growth, appreciation, union, stability. That's what's on your mind. That's why they're nervous. That's why they're in this energy that I'm feeling here. They're opening up their heart and they're ready to move forward. Releasing the old 444, balancing their energy. Your divine masculine is like, to them right now, the way that they're feeling is like they're taking on the whole world. <laughs> and they're preparing 
to tackle that world. Because now they're going to be putting in that work that you expected them to divine feminine and they didn't. It's time for things to grow between you and them. Union. Some of your divine masculines here, they may be nervous that you may ha um, have somebody else, but they don't care. They're coming. They're coming. They don't care. That's what's on the top. The empress, the sexy cow. They're coming for your sexy cow. They know exactly who you are and they're almost there. See, this is the same field. It's the same field, guys. But it's like it's just over there, over the other side of the hill. <laughs> over the other side of the hill. And it's like they see you. They have you in their vision. And they're so excited to see you. They don't even know what to say. They don't know what to do. They don't know what action to take. But they're ready. They are coming. They are coming. They are coming. They are coming. Nervousness. Nervous. Nervous. I'm hearing nervous as hell. Well, anyone going to hell would be nervous. <laughs> oh my God. So they better be saying, nervous, nervous, nervous. Tell me about this fool in regards to these divine masculines and this feeling that they're having, please. Okay, Father God. Your person has transformed. Your person has changed. Your person has changed. Your person is now allowing the universe to guide them. Your person has internal balance. Your person is healing. Your person is realizing that the love that they are looking for, it's already inside of them. And it is in you. Your person here, Divine Feminine, they know that they know that you truly love them and they're not gonna let you go they're coming for you this person is leaving some place of comfort and they're coming towards happiness yet they are nervous yet they are nervous It's like the negative energy from the past is trying to hold them back, trying to keep them from moving forward. So it's like creating a conflict within their mind to make them nervous. They see their abundance. They know what it is. They're planning for their abundance. They're aligning everything. Their heart is opening up. They're working on their inner childhood wounds. They're connecting to God. Spiritual connection is what they have right now. That spiritual connection that's guiding them to build their legacy with their divine feminine, their empress, the sexy cow. Tell me about this eight of pentacles, please. Like I said, they're working on their balance. They're balancing their energy and they're happy with the way that they're feeling now. They're happy. Some of your divine masculines are getting 911. Some of your divine masculines may have been um, juggling, juggling thoughts. Like I said, that negative thought in their mind is trying to keep them from moving forward. But they're not going to just sit around. They're contemplating and they're going to come to that realization that the best move is to move towards what they can build. Move towards what is like sustainable, what, what will keep them going, the love that they are looking for. Your person is no wiser. Your person is not allowing the past to keep them down. No, no, no. They're coming right back. 
Tell me about this Eight of Cups, please. In regards to these Divine Masculines, please. Yeah, baby. Told you so. You're coming back. Celebration. 10, 11, 12. Celebration. They're returning. And they're coming in fast and hot. I'm hearing an eagle. So some of you guys may maybe see eagles or it's just of significance to you. And hawks. I've been getting hawks for a while. But your person is turning their back to the outside world. And they're headed towards you. Because they now have that truth and that clarity with that king of swords. And their dream right now is to build and create and manifest a legacy of their own. And that legacy, they want to do it with you. They want to build it with you. One, one, one. Tell me about the seven of wands in the reverse here, please. Whoa, wow. What did I say, guys? They want to build and manifest this situation with you. That's why they're now being free, opening up their heart, returning. They're manifesting and they're, they're doing this through spirit, through God, through the universe, praying manifesting I think they're watching my channel <laughs> I think they're watching my channel <laughs> yeah and this divine masculine look this is my masculine looky here uh, can you see that yeah it's wearing my bracelet, my protection bracelet. <laughs> it's wearing my protection bracelet. No wonder his heart is open up. <laughs> and no wonder if he is free to move forward. See, it's that protection bracelet that's allowing them to overcome that little negative thought in their mind. <laughs> and now they're moving forward. There's going to be some sort of communication coming in towards your divine feminine and there is also a gift. I don't know what the gift is, but there's a gift that's coming your way. Your divine masculine has overcome their shadow side. It's like they've been through all their wounds that they need to heal. They have healed and now it's like, yeah, God just like, now it's time for you to go. And it's like they did that 360 in that one second. And they're going to come rushing in. Even though they're nervous. Yeah, I would be nervous too. Tell me about the Seven of Pentacles, please. I would be nervous too. So like I said, some of these divine masculines are... It, the, I mean, the way that they feel, they feel like they're carrying the, the, the weight of the world on their shoulders. But it's not for a bad thing. It's because they want to approach you for a new beginning. It's because they want to make the situation work. It's because it's time to be together and everything is being revealed. They're headed towards a new direction, and that direction is leading them towards their Ten of Pentacles, their legacy. And here you have the Four of Cups. See that little negative thought in your mind is trying to take them back to when they refuse your offer or offers. When they rejected your cup. To make them say, oh my God, this person is not going to want to talk to me any at all. Okay, I'm not going again. Negativity is so creative. 1444 and number four. So 4444. Four, four, four. They know they're on the right path. They can feel it now. Because now the universe is guiding them. 
Now the universe is guiding them. Somebody may love the color green or red. The universe is guiding your divine masculine now. They are closing out cycle. And they're ready to move forward. See that? Yeah, they got they got they gotta fight against this internal battle that they're having. They gotta fight against internal this internal battle and move towards your desires. It's like every part of them. See. That's your desire again, the Ten of Pentacles, to build a family life, to build a legacy, to build a home, to create your own traditions. Some of you guys, either you may love pearls or it's your birthstone or something, but your person is quite contented with where they're at now and the changes that they have made. Your person here has been working very hard and manifesting financial abundance. They now have clarity. They can see clearly. They know where they're going. They're spiritually connected. They're spiritually connected and they're realizing that this love between you and them is infinite. It's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. So why, why should I try and, and refuse it? No, no. Why should I not believe that this love is coming from God? They want to give it a try. They want to give it a try. The golden mirror. Being self-absorbed, absorbed, narcissist, one-sided relationship, and love bombing. Okay, so this situation between you and them is going to transition, change. From a one-sided relationship to your person love bombing you. That's what's going to happen now. Because now they have that confidence. Now they have that confidence to move forward. Now they have that confidence to express their emotions, to say to you what they really wanted to say. Because like I said, God just snapped the finger and said it's time to go. And then it's like that 5D consciousness came down. And now they're moving forward. Frustrated in relationship. See, some of your divine masculines, they were in, a, in another situation, juggling between you and that person. And it's because, again, because of the lack of confidence that they have within themselves, within relationships, is the reason why they refused or it was hard for them to move forward in the past. But your divine masculine is over that situation. They're over that situation. Like I said, there's a message coming in. This person is going to express their love to you. I am coming. I just heard that. I am coming. You can call me by my name. I am ready to roll. Once the rules remain the same, I will never cop out. The lioness is on the rise. New face, new face, let's start over, something brand new, rekindling this connection between you and them. But they don't know that this love between you and them, it never died, so there's no rekindling. It's just continuing, let's grow together, let's transform together. Let's heal together, 1919, that's 1010. Completing that cycle for an ending. One ending brings a new beginning. Brings a new beginning. Well, right now your divine masculine is free. Feeling that freedom. Feeling that freedom. But they're nervous. <laughs> but they're nervous. Some of your divine masculines may be moving in with you. Are you moving in with your divine masculine? But they have plans as well. They have plans. 
They're coming to see you is what I just heard. They're coming to see you. They may be setting up a date. Okay, thank you. They may be setting up a date here. Your person is brand new. Your person is changed and transformed. This is not the same person that you're here complaining about. <laughs> Romance is blooming. Someone likes you. Fun flirting. Want to date. Yes. Want to date. So they have you on their mind. They have their intentions, I tell you. They have their intentions. And they want to start over. They want to start over. Yeah, they want to take the mask off. Dropping that mask. Transcending obstacles. They're dropping that mask. They are going to be showing their true feelings now. Because before they weren't. And it's because of past situations. But just know they were pretending. They were pretending. That they didn't like you as much as you like them. Pretending little buggers. See that? Because they know who you are. They could feel it. They know before you did. You are spiritually connected. You are soulmates. You are twin flame. You are connected. You have a contract to fulfill. And nothing happens before it's time, guys. Okay, Father God, what are these divine masculines bringing in, please? What are these divine masculines bringing in, please? <laughs> Themselves and the gift. <laughs> two one two you may be seeing that number they're bringing themselves this person may be younger than you are they're bringing a gift they're coming in to open up your heart they're coming in with abundance prosperity and that includes everything there is that you've ever dreamed of that's what abundance is not just money 33 33 not just money happiness joy a home Prosperity, love, and money. Yeah, that voice. What else can you tell me that they're bringing in here, please, Father God? Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so beautiful. You see that? That's how you know they're coming, guys. That's how you, they show up. They show up and they're showing out. And they're bringing gifts. Your person is very nervous. Look at this little puppy. Look, look at his face. This person is very nervous. Are you going to accept my friendship? Can we start over? Can we start over, Divine Feminine? Are you going to accept my friendship? My offer of abundance? That's your business out there if you don't want to accept it. I'd accept it. Because I'm tired of the running around. I'm tired of the deception. I'm tired of the separation. <laughs> you know what you got to do? Just set your boundaries, Divine Feminines. Set your boundaries. But when that offer is coming, Divine Feminines, don't you dare turn it away. Because like I said, nothing happens before it's time and you don't decide when you're ready god does god does but if you're still in the early stages and you're still angry and you're still being jealous and you know worried what the divine masculine is gonna do if they come back into your life you still have a little bit more work to do but if you're no longer concerned with those things or anything that's happening around your divine masculine life, and then this person shows up and wanting to start over, well, yeah. Follow the signs and synchronicities. Six of Cups coming in back towards you. Divine guidance, six and one, seven. Divinely guided together. Your person sees you as a star as well. 
someone maybe in the spotlight there was a lot of challenges here divine feminine a lot of delays between you and this person there was also um there's right now there is also no communication or just a little bit tinsy wins a bit but look forward for more communication once that blockage has been removed from your divine masculine and no, we won't know when the blockage is removed. You know when you'll know when it's removed? When you get that contact. <laughs> when you get that contact. Look. Look. They're coming in with the Ace of Wands, baby. They're coming in with that commitment. But you already know what you want, Divine Feminine, because look at this. You already accepted that rose. You already accept that rose. You already accept that rose. So you can just be there talking about, oh, I don't know if I want it, or I don't know. But you well know that when these my maskings come back, you're gonna you don't even are gonna have to wait until they say, Will you? Oh yes, of course, sure, 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 buddy. Sure, buddy, sure, buddy. <laughs> sure. See all this confusion and the anxiety that I'm talking about? They're anxious. They're anxious. They're nervous. They're nervous. They want to end this separation. Because they're coming in to build something brand new. They're, they know that they're coming towards karma waters, divine feminines. They know that. No guessing, no if, no buts. No maybes. Completing cycle. This divine masculine may have separated from someone here. But they're ready to take that leap of faith. They're ready. See, this rose is all dried up and ugly. That situation is done with. Over and done with. There's no more love in that situation. No more love. That situation, that past situation, your masculine gave them, they're all, oh boy. And they killed it. They killed it, little buggers. They killed it. Beouches. That's what you call beouches. Killing love. My God. But your person is definitely coming. They're just nervous. So you might have that feeling. They're nervous. Let's get you some messages here from the Archangels. I am ready to roll. Hmm. You're that, your divine masculine is ready. Ready. Jesus. <laughs> there you go. And you want to tell me my readings are true? Nah, baby. Nah, baby. Look at this. You know what this means for the new ones? Can the older ones tell the newer ones what this means when Twin D gets this card? Somebody's coming to your home. Somebody's coming to see you. Bam. Divine order, baby. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Clear cognizance, Archangel Uriel. Pay attention to thoughts and ideas that come to you as you're answered. Purrs, just like I said, Divine Feminine. You will feel that energy. When the divine masculines have made that decision to come forward you're gonna feel it 29 29 11 11 you're gonna feel it pay attention to the signs that you're getting all is well no wonder it's a 911 partially and here are the sirens again all is well archangel jeremy and everything is happening exactly as it, as it is supposed to with hidden blessings, you will soon understand. You will get the meaning of everything very, very soon. 
So be gentle with yourself, Archangel Sandal Fan. Be very gentle with yourself at this time. Surround yourself with gentle people, situations, and environments. And you have indigo and crystal children. Some of you guys may have children. And there's definitely going to be babies. Go outside. Get some fresh air. And I think when you go outside, you also be getting those clues. Like the birds that I would mentioned at the beginning. You'll be getting those clues for whomever this is for, guys. You're protected. And both of you, your hearts are healing, which is bringing forth your divine ma masculine. Take care of yourselves, everyone. Don't forget to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. And when you subscribe... Press that notification bell and select all and make sure you have notification turned on on your YouTube app on your cell phone because it doesn't matter if you want to hit that bell. If you don't have notifications on your cell phone on, it's not going to come through. So make sure you have that turned on and you can click your next message to watch here, 111. Love you guys to purchase my book and my keychains and my protection bracelets and my money oils and money magnet bracelets the link is in the description box below on my website twindyholisticboutique.square.site and for my book it's twindyflamed.square.site love you all and i thank you for your support and i'll see you in tomorrow's let go and let god everyone love you all Mwah.